Welcome to the Edition Guard WordPress plugin screencast. In this screencast, we're going to show you how to set up your WordPress site to work with Edition Guard using our free plugin. The first thing we need to do is go to our WordPress site's admin dashboard. So I'm currently looking at our dashboard here, and we go to the plugins menu and click Add New. Then Search for Edition Guard. And then once the result comes up, click Install Now. And then click OK to the prompt. Finally, activate the plugin. Now you should have a new menu on the left called Edition Guard, as well as a listing under the plugins. The Edition Guard ebook sales with DRM. Now that we've installed the plugin, we need to configure it. So go to the new Edition Guard menu and click General Settings. You come to a page with five different fields. The first, the Edition Guard account email, the second, shared secret, and there's also three email settings. The first two you actually get from your Edition Guard account page is the email address and the shared secret. Simply copy and paste those in there. And the last three, they can be anything you want. The sender name is basically the name displayed on the email sent by the system. And the other two email settings are just those used by the system. You can put in anything in those as well. Once you've put in everything, simply click Save Changes and then your Edition Guard configuration is going to be complete. Now your next step is going to be configure your PayPal settings. So go to PayPal settings, and then put in your PayPal email address in the first field. So this is going to be the email address you signed up to PayPal with. There's also a second option called test mode. So this allows you to use the sandbox or the live system of PayPal. If you want to do actual transactions, leave this as no. Save changes. Now that we're done configuring, let's upload an ebook. Go to My Ebooks and then put in a title and then an author and publisher. Then put in any price you want. And leave currency at US dollars and then just select the actual file you want to upload from the choose file dialog and save the ebook. In the background, WordPress communicates with Edition Guard and the ebook information has been saved successfully. You should also see a listing of the ebook you added below. Now let's use this in a post. Let's add a new post. The title The Art of War. And let's place an image to make it look nice. But you can put in anything you want into a post. And then below this image, we're actually going to put a short code. To do so, click the small E icon, select the ebook and the payment method, then click Insert into Post. And the short code gets generated automatically for you. Then simply Publish. Now let's see how this post looks. So once we view the post, you can see that the image is there also with the book information and the purchase button below. And when we click the purchase button, we actually get a checkout form where the first name, last name, and the email address of your customer is collected. And then they can also click the make payment using PayPal button and the order is being processed and finally the customer lands at the PayPal page with all the information. They can simply put in their password, log in, and pay for the book. Once the customer completes payment, they're going to receive a special download link through email which will allow them to download and open the ebook inside of Adobe Digital Editions, which is free software from Adobe. That concludes our screencast. Please let us know if you have any questions or problems with the process at support at editionguard.com. Thank you for watching.